Hello, I am Dr. Kim kyung of Online Surgery. Today, I'm going to look at surgery video with you and talk about surgery. The patient of the day is 62-year-old male patient. The lower left was missing in this case. The periodontal condition was not very good and the lower right there was a lot of mobility on teeth. On upper right the periodontal condition was not very good and the patient was complaining pain. In top left there was no teeth in the mandible and there was no occlusion so the patient did not experience any pain but periodontal condition was not very good and this was why the patient came in. As the patient wanted, the patient wanted to be able to chew from the left, so implant plans were made on a lower left. The anterior lower bridge didn't look very good and there was mobility and later they should be extracted and implant plans onward was planned. Positioning guide was used for placing three implants, number four, number six, and seven. Let's look at the CT, number four, number six, and number seven. Alveolar bone condition is comparatively favorable. A number four implant placement is going to be done first. Positioning guide kit was shown at doctor's tip, easy hands on earlier two premolars, two molars, single positioning guide were used to get position. And number five implant is not going to be placed, so number four is going to be done first, and number six bridging guide is going to be used to get position, and placement is going to be done. After placing number six, superior to the fixture, guide pin is going to be used and number seven is going to be placed. And that is the sequence. As you can see, behind canine premolar type single guide, two of them were used and two molar type were used to get position. And you can see the occlusion with the antagonist. Number four and number six, the distance between them were 14 millimeter and the bridge was used so that 14 millimeters are a part of these two implants. And this was the implant placement plan. This is post-op x-ray. As you can see, it is slightly close to canine. Let's look at CT. It does not touch upon canine root. Actually, the lower anterior extraction is going to be done and implant is going to be placed. So at present, it's not going to be a huge problem. Post-op, the patient did not complain of any symptoms. In number four, implant placement was done. Number six and number seven, implants were placed. And you can see that on CT. Let's look at the surgery video. Relax. Incision is going to be made from the distal towards the front using blade number 15. Crystal incision and vertical incision in between. You need to make incision nicely and reflect the full thickness flap. A little bit of water. Guide pin is placed and single guide position is being checked. As shown, antagonist relation is checked. Bridge guide is used so that they are 14 millimeters apart. The position of number 36 is being checked.
close slightly, say ah. Are you in pain? Bite on your molars. Which TS do you want? Close slightly. The bone was quite hard, so 5.0 taper drill was used approximately 50%, and TS3 4.5 by 10 millimeter implant is placed. To place implant in number 7, pre-mount is going to be removed for now. In number 36, in the placed area, fixture type guide pin is going to be placed and 8.0 millimeter single guide is going to be connected. The posterior position is going to be checked and 8.0 single guide is going to be used to, to get the drilling position. Close slightly. See ya. We are all done. The distal one is slightly closer towards the front because of the antagonist relation. Side cutting drill is going to be used to expand distally. Distal expansion has been done. Compared to the original plan, it's placed slightly more distally. Four point five one to two taper drill is going to be done using five point zero. Approximately fifty to seventy percent drilling is done. Bone quality is quite hard. 4.5 by 8.5 KS3BA implant is going to be placed.
Are you okay? To use our style beacon, smart peg is connected. The most distant one, ISQ, is approximately 89. The one on the front is 84. The one on the middle is slightly less, 65. Suture is complete. Surgery is now complete. Thank you for watching.